Uh, thanks to Stu for those early races today. Stu's going to be taking through the bulk of the top races this week at Liverpool. I'm going to start off with the Fox Hunter, which is normally the sort of race that Stu does. Anyways, Ajahn Sinner for Derek Hinton, Ishara Stu Gray, Moleskin Jones for John Morgan, Skull Doggery Pleasant, Patrick Hogan, Albany Early, Thomas Rogers, Bond Issue, Daniel French, Broadhurst, and Delilah for Matt Cooper, 15 Love. Or Graham Clinton, Gordet, Kevin Meanhan, Jane Burden, Martin Dillon, Lola, Jane Stu Gray, Maximum Mayhem, Alex Cherry, Solway Breeze, John Morgan, and Zartina, actress for Alex Cherry. So 15 runners in the Hunters National sort of thing. And they're away and racing. Well, there is a Hunters National Day 3. It's a short run to the first. And they're all safely over it. And heading their way towards the second of the 18 and it's Zartina actress who's going to lead them into it and over it they go that will be the last on the next circuit and now they're going to push towards the chair which is a test that comes up pretty quickly although to be fair I don't remember seeing many fallers at the chair in the years I've been doing the SO commentating as they get to it now they all once again get over it okay so Zartina actress going to settle down into the lead Jane Burden is second, 15 Love is third, then Solway Breeze and Moleskin Jones as they take the water with Maximum Mayhem after that one on the field. All and all the way back to Bond Issue is just a back marker as they swing left handed then and race out onto the back part of the track and race up towards the fence that'll be the first in the Grand National tomorrow. And Zartina Actress is the clear leader from Moleskin Jones in second. 15 low in third, Jane Burden is fourth. In Solway Breeze and Maximum Mayhem, Albany Early and Ashara. And Delilah is after that one. And Ajard Sinner, Lola Jane and Broadhurst. And finally Gordet, Skullduggery, Pleasant and Bond issue as they get to the fifth. And they're all safely over the fifth. Heading down to the next. The fence is caught thick and fast on this part of the track. And all safely over that and now heading to the big ditch. First big test in the national tomorrow, this ditch, although you could argue the first fence is the first big test because they go at it too quickly, usually. And they get to this ditch, and over it they go, and they're all safely over it, they're all jumping well, and heading down towards the next. With Zartina actress clearing the lead, Moleskin Jones and Jane Burden sharing second, as they all skip over that one nicely. Called it wide on the track in the green with the orange cap for Kevin Minahan. Plenty of Orange towards the front as they get over the ninth. And they're all safely over the ninth as well. With Zartina actress, the clear leader from Jane Burden and Moleskin Jones. And then Gordet. As they get to Beaches. And again, all safely over that as well. They've softened these fences up quite a bit over the years. And Zartina actress is the leader. Over Foynaven. Safely over that one as well with Gordet second, Moleskin Jones in third, and then Albany early fourth. With Maximum Mayhem, Delilah, Jane Bird has lost her place and dropped back on the rail. And Ishara and 15 Love as they head down to the canal turn. And all safely over that one as well. And so I've seen the actress will lead them into Valentine's. The lead is down to just a couple though now. And that Valentine's looks ridiculously small, doesn't it? And it's Zartina actress who's in front from Solway Breeze and 15 Love, then Gordet and Moleskin Jones and Jane Burden as they get over the next one. Oh, we've lost one there. It's Albany Early's gone. So it took us at a 14th fence until we lost anything. The first one out is Albany Early as they get over the 15th. That's a ditch, the final ditch. And they're all safely over it with Zartina actress, the clear leader from Songway Breeze, who's now moved into second. Gordet is third. Jane Bird moves through on the inside. Then comes Skullduggery Pleasant, who's getting a little bit closer as well. And Maximum Mayhem heads the chasing pack. Was that coming through out of that pack? Is it Ashara? But it's still Zartina actress, who's been in the lead all the way from Solway Breeze in second. Jane Burden is third, then 15 Love and Moleskin Jones. Gordet is next. Gordoggery Pleasant. Ishara is coming with a strong looking run on the outside, and Ajard Sinner is trying to get into it as well. Lola Jane still there, so is Delilah Bond. Issues only 10 lengths off the leader, and Maximum Mayhem being pushed along at the back, and Broadhurst has tailed off. They're coming down towards the final two, then now. 
and it's Zartina Akras who lands and she's gone Zartina Akras has gone been in the lead all the way and crashes out at the second last leaving Solway Breeze in the lead from Jane Burden on the inside School Doggery present on the outside Ajard Sinner is next Lola Jane coming through with a run on the outside over the final fence they go and it's Solway Breeze who lands in front from Jane Burden in second then comes School Doggery present in third Moleskine Jones is running on Gordex trying to get back into it as well but it's Solway Breeze who's clear by a length and a half coming down to the elbow Solway Breeze from from Jane Burden in second, Moleskin Jones is in third, then comes School Doggery Pleasant, Bond issue, he's finishing well, but it's Solway Breeze who's hanging on, and Solway Breeze is going to take it for John Morgan, Solway Breeze wins it, Jane Burden is second, Moleskin Jones is third, then Bond issue and 15 love after that, and all the way back to Delilah, and I'm going to say it's another one for John Morgan, it might well be Daniel French, but I think it's John Morgan, Jane Burden second, it was indeed. Solway Breeze for John Morgan, the winner. Just got in luck. Top weight, 110. Jane Burden for Martin Leland was second. Moleskin Jones for John Morgan again was third. And we lost the cards gone down right there. Bond issue for Daniel French was fourth. And 15 love for Graham Clutterbuck was fifth. I'm just a little bit confused there because that's actually not been run as a handicap, has it? It's been run as a straight race. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be a handicap, but it's too late now. 